I'm Donna Sheely, and this is my weekend entertainment wrap up. Wrapping up some of the biggest stories that happened in entertainment this week. The biggest TV comeback just had the biggest fall when ABC canceled their number one hit sitcom, Roseanne. Roseanne sent out a racist tweet about former Obama advisor Valerie Jarrett, then deleted the tweet and replaced it with an apology and blamed Ambien. But it was too late. ABC's president Channing Dungy, a sister, made the announcement that the comments weren't ABC's values and the show was canceled. Tiffany Haddish is being sued by her ex-husband for $1 million in a defamation lawsuit. In her book, she says that her ex was abusive. He sees it another way. No response from Tiffany as of yet. She is, however, on the cover of W Magazine, and she is hosting the MTV Movie and TV Awards on June 18th. Morgan Freeman fights back at CNN. If you remember last week, he was accused of inappropriate behavior and sexual harassment. He quickly issued an apology. Now Freeman has switched it up and says CNN used falsehoods. CNN, on the other hand, stands by their reporting. And BET's longtime CEO and chairman, Deborah Lee, is calling it quits and has resigned her post. She was with the company for 32 years. That's a quick wrap-up of this week's entertainment stories. For more stories and information, go to tlcnaptown.com.